In this video, I will discuss how to make a very good CV in LaTeX and this is one of the template that I have. This is the class of this template. So I will provide this template including with this class in the description of the video. So one may download from there and can go on with making a CV. So let's go on with this. For example, this is the CV in 2020 and here we are. So let me let me zoom this one in order to see it clearly. First build this one is I have already done some options here. Then it will appear here and I will discuss it one by one. The first thing here is that I am having the document class is the res which is from the resume and this class is already in this folder. So I am having in the options the margin and the line. The two packages that I am having here is the hyperref and the URL they are relevant to each other and then this brick equation like br equation so we are having these packages these packages are supposed to be downloaded first and then we can build the document or if the internet will be active then these packages will be downloaded by itself some options are defined here which will keep them by default like the top margin and the bottom margin etc we will have to keep them as it is some other options are here for example we are having the new envi environment like list one and list two so we will have to keep them as they are if they, it will be required then we will do some changes here otherwise we will keep them by default now our cv actually starts from here with the begin document and whatever we write between the begin document and end document it will appear in our cv so starting from here the very first one is the name and then it is in the large size so i can change this one i cannot change the slash name because it is inside the class it is defined inside the class however i can change this one to smaller or bigger font than this one so i will write the name here then h fill means horizontally it will fill all this line and then we will have the slash em and slash today means it will just write the date here so the date is a little up here and it is inside the class this formatting is there so it will write here the date then i will start with the begin resume and then it will end up with the end resume here so starting from the very first the very first one here is the contact information and it is here so i will write the very first the contact information the v space here is defined we can change this one it is this space uh, which we will keep here this is the vertical space and it will be space after this one so I have written in a tabular form like the contact information is the section and now in a tabular form the first table means the column here is having the width is equal to 3.5 and the next is 3 inches so this is the first one here and this is the second one here so this table is having actually two columns here i will write the details here for example associate professor department of physics the cellular number the email and all this and here it is for details that how to make a table i have already included a, a video in the comprehensive uh, series so one can consider it for how to make a table and then the url means i can add the website here 
so let me go to this table so i have added an email and an email you see with the slash url package now it is clickable so this one is clickable the website is clickable now after the contact information our table actually ends here and then the personal information comes in and in the personal information i am again having a two column table and i can write here that uh, over here like the father name i will write the father name the date of birth and then the place of birth domicile etc i can add many information here just i will have to put the enter sample and then i can put many other information and then i will end this table as well and after this another section i can add and i can do is many writing here is required i have just done two inputs here two research fields i have entered so they are here now in the next section when we are having education so in education we the first one that we have here is the university or the institute then i have just made it bold and here you can see that slash bold face means that it will be bold i can write the city the country here and then after the country now in the same row i want to put the dates from uh, which this degree has been completed so i will write slash h fill h fill will actually horizontally fill this and this last letter will come at the end of the page here on the right side so the h fill command is very necessary to give here for the alignment purposes and then i will enter this one here i will go to the new line and here i can write the degree and his degree is here so i will enter this one again and the new line will come here and so on so this way i can write the education qualification here now i can see here that i have not used any table environment here so i am just separating this one with the help of the hfill command similarly the rest of this will be filled and i can add up many sections i want for example the professional experience now here the enter sample has been used for this experience to come down and some of the letters i have made bold some is normal and i can add up as many i want i can add sections here similarly research funding i have simplified it to the maximum so that one can easily write the cv in this template another section and now in this section i want to use bulleted list so the counting is here one and two here so now unlike the latex the other uh, commands begin enumerate or begin itemize i will have to use the less two format here so it has already defined over here in this class that what is list what should be the formatting for the list and so on so i can come here to the publications and inside the publication the first line i am just making is bold and then i am giving a link here as well so i will put slash url and then this portion will end i can go on with begin enumerate and in enumerate is usual and they will be one two like this one then come to the references so i will have to add up the references here like the recommendation letters are from these persons so the name of the person and then details like the email id the address the phone number etc i can give all them here and the 
when i give the email id then i will have to write the slash url so it will become clickable when i click this then it will open this email id and this will end the resume and will end the document as well so this way we can design a very good looking cv i can see here in a pdf document here so let's see this is the cv that their template can make the dates and all the information and if i will have to include the picture here as well then two things i will have to add up here it means the first one will be the graphics package and then i will just write here in one of the column here include graphics and then i will give the image location so this way i can design a cv very easily and very comprehensively